Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Kindergarten 2. Last episode, we left off freeing Nugget from that sewer grate, and then we were about to start his mission. This time, we are going to try to help him out as much as we can and make Nugget Cave 2.0. If you guys are cool with that, you're down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go. Okay, guys, so Nugget is free. He's right here. We're going to talk to him. The first of the things Nugget needs for his plan is a lighter. Nugget needs a lighter brought into the school. You say Nugget a lot. Keen observation. Has Nugget's potential friend also noticed the green of the grass and the blue of the sky? Are you being sarcastic? Okay, fair enough, dude. So he needs a lighter. And we are going to definitely give it to him. We got to talk to good old Monty. I feel so bad for him. He always looks like he's about to cry. I don't actually need your help to get up the ramp. Okay, we know that. Oh, no. Okay, so we got to restart the day. Because I need a lighter, right? Has Nugget's potential friend found a lighter for Nugget? I'm still looking. Okay, so I think I gotta restart the day, guys. And we gotta get the lighter before we do anything else. So let's go back to the schoolyard. And yes, guys, I moved my face cam down so you guys could actually see the words that are above me. So what we're gonna do before we do anything else... We are gonna get a lighter from Monty. Actually, wait, this is gonna be contraband, right? This snitch right here is actually gonna try to take that away from me. You know what? Let's try it out. Let's buy a lighter. There you go. And then, um, let's free Nugget and let's see if this snitch is actually gonna tell on me. Oh my! You heard the bell. You're not supposed to be... I'm sorry, I couldn't help but notice that you have some contraband on you. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to confiscate it. How did you know that? What? I just... I don't know how. I'll just make this easy for me and hand it over. Are you allowed to confiscate it? Of course. My mommy is the principal. She wants to keep the school safe. You'll have to report to study hall. Now let's get you to class. What a freaking bitch! She's a snitchy bitch! Okay, kids. Teacher has a headache, so we're gonna be very quiet. It looks like this school has more funding than the last one. Okay, we know what you're gonna say. But I gotta help Nugget out. Nuggy Wuggy. Nugget likes the fidgety spinny. That's nice, Nugget. Okay, so I guess I have to restart the day, guys. Because I can't even leave, right? Aw, oh, man. Okay, whatever. I'm dead. We gotta figure out how we're gonna get the lighter into the school. Alright, guys, you see this Latina right here? We gotta talk to her. And I gotta give her, like, a Latina accent. Hey, you must be one of the new kids. I'm Carla. Do you have any contraband on you? That's a strange question. Well, these are some strange times. I'm just trying to save you some study hall. No one gets in here out- That- that is not a Latina accent. But, um, we're gonna try to- <laughs> We're gonna try to get some contraband in with her. Yeah, and her name is Penny. The blonde girl is the biggest snitch in school and she has a knack for knowing who is carrying stuff. How does she know? No idea, but it's unwise to bring anything in these walls unless you have a special way of getting it in. Can you get stuff in? Well, if you want to get it past the living metal detector over there, I can offer you my services for a small fee. Sure. What do you want smuggled in? Okay, let me buy a lighter first. Let me get the lighty lighty. Blau. Okay, 150 for a lighter? Come on, man, you're ripping me off. You might as well be robbing me blind. Okay, so let's smuggle in the lighter for a dollar. Consider it done. It'll be in the blue locker upstairs. Thank ya. Okay, so now we're gonna rescue Nugget. And should I even give him a flower yet? Uh, how are we gonna do this? Should I give the flower, guys? You know what? We're not gonna give the flower, and then let's see what he says during morning time. Let's see if he'll talk to us. Wait, what do you mean, oh my? I don't even have anything on me! You heard the bell. You're not supposed to be here. Only the differently abled are allowed to use the handicap ramp. Oh, okay. Are you differently abled? Um, no. I mean, yes, sorta. Just not like... Never mind. The point is you shouldn't be here. You don't want to be late for your first day. Okay, go to class. I thought she was gonna take my lighter from a different dimension or something. Okay, so let's talk to Nuggy Wuggy. Please. Nugget, talk to me. Nugget likes the fidgety spinny. That's nice, Nuggets. Okay, maybe I don't talk to him during morning time. So let me see if I can go pee pee and poo poo. I need to use the bathroom. Well, too bad. I don't have a bathroom pass for this new school yet. You'll just have to hold it. You don't look like you can stop me. I can still give you study hall. Apparently, that's a punishment for stuff here. Go ahead. All right. So, I have study hall now. Right! I gotta be with big brain energy. Hold up, new kid. You're only allowed to use the bathroom, nothing else. So, I'm not allowed without a pass? Only until we can distribute pass books to you new kids. Now, either go to the bathroom or go back to class. Okay. I guess I can't get the lighter yet. How about you, man? Can you help me? Stupid lot. 
Can't get into the weapons closet. Damn it. Okay, how do I get that guy distracted? Damn it. He has eyes like a freaking hawk. Look at that. <laughs> What's wrong, Nugget? Nugget was hoping to dig a new Nugget cave, but Nugget has no way to dig one. That's rough, buddy. I think I know what to do. I think I gotta start the janitor mission, go inside the weapons closet, get the shovel, and then end up doing Nugget's mission. I think that's what I gotta do. You know what, guys? I just realized something. I think this is Nugget's face right here, and I have to do these missions where the arrows are pointing to, like, help out the mission that I need to do here. So I don't think that I can do Nugget's mission yet because I have an arrow of the item that I got from here that points to Nugget right here. I think that's Nugget. And then I have to do another mission that points to Nugget again. So I think I have to do the Hitman's Potty Guard. And to start it, I have to talk to Felix and then Ted. Oh. I think this douchebag right here is Ted. So I think you're Felix. I told you already, Teddy. The plan is foolproof. Just do exactly what I told you and... I know. It's just... I don't know, Felix. The whole thing seems so wrong. All he hasn't done anything to us. It'll be fine. Quit being such a... Ahem. <clears throat> How long have you been listening to our little chat? Not long. Good. I wouldn't want Ted here to get in trouble. Hey. Why would I get in trouble? I didn't do anything. Which is just so typical for you, Teddy. <sighs> I'll just save our family's company myself. Good luck with that. And then I talk to you, right? Oh, hey. I'm Ted. Why aren't you in on Felix's plan? Because he's a good-for-nothing disgrace to my family's name. I'm sorry, Felix. I just want to help. I can do this. Maybe I can explain better during morning time. I'll be in the regular class. The stupid class. Ugh. The stupid class. If you want to talk then. Okay, see you then. Okay, cool. I can't wait to get started. Now that I think about it, we can start now. What are you trying to accomplish? Just help me with this one part, and I'll tell you the rest during morning time, okay? Okay, what do we need to do? Well, we're gonna need to distract Ozzy during morning time. Talk to him and see if you can figure out what will draw his attention. Okay. And I'm gonna need someone who I can stage a fight with. Probably a girl. Although, with the resonating, I'm not sure if there are any in the, uh, dumb class. I know a dumb girl. Teddy, you can't pull this off. I'll handle it. Let it go. I'm gonna try. You'll see. Uh, thank you guys for listening to that horrible accent. I don't even know if that was British, Australian. I don't even know what that is. I pulled that out of my anal hole, okay? But she's a dumb girl, so we're gonna talk to her. This new school is so much more my style, especially the new selection of boys. What do you think? Ted wants your help with something. Ooh, how forward. I've only been here for like five seconds and I'm already being propositioned. Yeah, wow, amazing. Well then, he'll just have to go through a little test. Here's some gum. If he makes it find its way into another girl's hair, then it's a date. I'll let him know. I don't like it when a man keeps me waiting. I want it done before the bell rings. Chop, chop. Okay, he'll get right into it. So, Ted, you gotta do what you gotta do. So, is there a girl you can set me up with? Yup. Ew. Why did you give me some chewed up gum? Stick it in a girl's hair. What? That's so mean. But my plan. Will this girl go along with my plan if I do this? I think so. Okay, I guess I'll just stick this in Carla's hair. Why not Penny? No! Uh, I mean, Carla is mean sometimes. She deserves gum in her hair more than Penny. Okay, go do it. Huh, <sighs> I'm really sorry about this, Carla. Sorry about what? You haven't done any... Oh, poor Carla. Oh, so that's how it's gonna be? Well, you just made yourself an enemy, Ted. I'd watch your back if I was you. I'm really sorry, but I have this really elaborate plan to... GET AWAY FROM ME! Oh man, she seemed really mad. I feel terrible. This is your plan. I know, but can you just go over there and see if she's okay? Maybe we can make it up to her later. I'll see what I can do. Oh, that was wonderful! You're gonna be an excellent boyfriend! Yeah, okay. It's all coming together. I'll see you in morning time. Good grief, Teddy. It's fine, Felix. My plan will work. You'll see. Oh, what the heck is wrong with Ted? He just came up and stuck gum in my hair. Anything I can do to help? That's nice, kid. I appreciate it. I could use some scissors to cut this crud out of my hair. Where can I get those? I know exactly where to get those. Upstairs, but since you're in the less gifted class, it would probably be easier for you to get them at lunch. Okay. Thanks, kid. Here's a vending machine coupon. I would do it myself, but I'm not allowed to use the machine anymore after I started counterfeiting these. Cool. 
Okay. So she's good. Let's talk to him again. My plan will work. We're gonna do this. Oh, Michael Jackson moonwalk again. Okay, so let's go to morning time, guys. And then let's see this little fight that Felix is gonna have with uh, Cindy. Oh, good. You're here. Felix has this scheme that's gonna help our family's company. But I have a better one. And no one wants to listen to it. What is it? I'll tell you, but you gotta promise not to tell anyone, though. Felix will be so mad if his plan gets ruined and it's my fault. I won't tell anyone. I want to use you to kill Ozzy. Oh my goodness. Why Ozzy? Well, you see, um, Felix said it's because... I actually don't know, but I think it has something to do with our inheritance. How do I kill him? Well, I want to give him an asthma attack. He uses his inhaler a lot. He keeps it in his cubby. Oh, so he's the one with that asthma. We're gonna need a long distraction. I figured we could pretend to fight or something to draw the teacher's attention and you could grab it. Okay, let's go get that inhaler. Right, but first we should handle Ozzy. You got something to distract him with, right? Aw, oh, crap. But, but without something to distract him with... Aw, oh, man, Felix was right. This was a stupid plan. Aw, oh, no. Okay, so I think I need the battery for the robot, and then I can come back here. So let's get that real quick. Okay, so this time we have something to distract him, which is the battery. Good thinking. He'll move to the other side of the class to play with Destructotron. Go give him that battery, and we can talk to Cindy. Destructotron was the best toy in the toy box. My friends and I used to play with him all the time before you new kids came in. Was it the best toy? Yeah, but now he's out of battery. No friends, no toys. You new kids are the worst, but you can have this battery, doll. Whoa, really? Thanks. Maybe you aren't so bad. Yeah, maybe. I'm gonna go play over by the toy box. I'll see you around, kid. See ya! Alright, time to get your inhaler, you sucker. With Orsi out the way, we're ready to make our move. When we start the distraction, be ready to grab that inhaler. Let's do it. Also, Felix didn't get a chance to empty his cubby before going to the smart class. There's some stuff in there that might be worth grabbing. Like money? I love money. No, no, no. The money is in my cubby. Felix's is to the right of Orsi's. Anyway, let's go start a distraction. Lead the way. What is that? A bag of weed? Lead the way. Okay. Um, I'll grab this. Hey! I know I look like death right now, but my eyes still work. No going through other people's cubbies. What? I thought I could get it, you little bitch. Oh, uh, what? Okay, Cindy. Let's talk to Cindy. I just love this doll. She's so pretty, just like me. We need you to cause a distraction. Oh, really? Sorry, sweetie, but I'd only do something like that for my boyfriend. Ted will be your boyfriend. Yeah, remember? We need to put on a show to distract the teacher. <laughs> oh yeah, that's my kind of date. Are you ready to go then? He is. Yeah, let's go. Be ready to grab that inhaler, kid. Follow me, boyfriend. We're about to have our first spat. Alright, make it a good one. Are you ready, sweetie? Ready for what? You haven't told me anything. Just play along. I've done this a million times. Play along with what? This doesn't... How dare you! Ow! Hey, that hurt! You're a jerk! Well, there's more where that came from. Hey, Cindy! Stop! Knock it off right now! Oh, there you go. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Let's get it. So let me get that inhaler. Ba blam This is Ozzy's cubby. It has his inhaler. Take that shit! And I also want to take this. This is Felix's cubby. I actually don't know what this is. Whatever it is, it's green and it's in a bag. Take the stuff! Okay, okay, I'll stop! But I'll kill him if he ever does that again! Not good enough, you little brat! You're getting study hall for this little incident. It was worth it. Did you get it? Please tell me you got it. I got it. Awesome. You're really good at this. Thanks. Now what? Now that we took away his lifeline, we just need to stress him out enough to trigger an asthma attack. What stresses him out? Aussie is a bit particular. He likes to do things a certain way. If we can break his routines, he should start freaking out. Where do we start? Lunch. He does a lot of really specific things there. It shouldn't be hard to throw him off his game. Okay, then. Attention, new kids! Okay, he's gonna give us the hall pass. We got it. I think I know what to do. Remember in the last episode, we went inside a bathroom stall, and he was actually tripping out that we were in his stall? I think that's what we gotta do. Oh, there you are! It's time to move forward with the next stage of the plan. What is it? What the devil are you talking to him for? What are you two doing? Oh! Uh, nothing, Felix. I'm just gonna show the new kid where the forks are. Follow me, new kid. Okay. 
Felix can't know that we're doing this. I want to do it just the two of us so he knows that I can take charge of stuff. Okay. In a few minutes, Aussie's gonna leave and use the bathroom. You need to take the stall on the left. That's the stall he likes. So what? It'll stress him out. That's the name of the game here. You just have to keep putting pressure on him until he cracks. Now go to that stall and wait for him. Okay. Oh, Felix is watching. Here's a fork so we don't look suspicious. Okay. Also, did you talk to Carla? Will she forgive me? She wants scissors. Of course. Well, you should probably do that while you're out as well. Good idea. Why, is that his real girlfriend? What are you doing? You cannot leave. You have not eaten yet. Aw, oh, shit. I forgot I gotta buy a boiga. Alright, so let's buy a ham boiga. And then now, we are gonna take a shit in Ozzy's stall. I have a burger! Get away from me, you bug-eyed freak! Alright, there we go. Okay. Hey, man. You need a pass to be out here. Go back to lunch or I'm giving you study hall. I have one. Oh, a bathroom pass. Okay, go ahead. Thanks. And I gotta get upstairs. Back it up, kid. Your pass is for the bathroom. Not upstairs. I can't let you go up there. What can I do so you'll let me up? Hmm. Well, that little narc took my cigarettes this morning. You wouldn't happen to have something to smoke, would you? I do. I have the bag of weed. Cha -ching. Whoa! This is even better than cigarettes. Thanks, man. You're welcome. All right, you pimple face freak. Let's uh, go get the scissors. Because we got to snip, snip that gum out the hair. Use coupon on passbook. Use coupon on scissors. Damn, a passbook? Isn't that like the ultimate pass to go anywhere I want? But you know what? We got to do it for Carla. We got to do it for Carla. So let's go inside the stall. And then uh, use the bathroom on the left. Wait, he's already here? Uh, hey, is anyone out there? I need some toilet paper. There isn't any in here. Aw, uh, son of a slut bag. Okay, I gotta restart that. Okay, guys, so instead of giving this loser some weed, we're actually just gonna go inside the stall already. Like, we're just gonna chill right here. Bam. And where's Ozzy? Wait, Ozzy? Oh, Ozzy's coming up right now. Damn it. Okay, we gotta use it again. Here we go. What the? Who's in there? This is my stall. I use it every day. Come out right now. I'm not done yet. Unacceptable. Everyone knows this is my stall. Now hurry up and finish. Just use the other one. The other one? I'd rather die than die. Ugh. You haven't heard the last of this kid. Bye, Ozzy. I feel bad for him, but you know what? He's gotta die. If he dies, he dies. I'm gonna leave the biggest shit stains on his toilet. I saw Ozzy come back earlier than usual. Does that mean you did it? Yup, he's not happy. Why am I talking to him from all the way over here? Excellent. I'll see you at recess. We'll get what we need to set him off. See you then. Okay. Um, so I think we just skip. And then now we go to recess. Alright, and I saw a Monster Mon card on top of the rock climbing thing, so I'm gonna try to do that. Have you seen my inhaler? I thought I left it in my cubby, but it's not here. Sorry, I haven't seen it. Darn it. Good thing I keep a backup in my locker upstairs. I'll just use that if anything happens. Uh-oh. Okay. Where do you think you're going? You're not allowed inside. Oh man. Damn it. I don't know what to do. Should I try and climb the wall? Yes. Don't you die. Don't you die. If you die, I will revive you and kill you again. Come on. Oh, what? Okay, I actually had to climb that. Stupid. Okay. Come on. Oh. Oh, no. Okay. I actually have to do something. Okay. Oh, my God. I suck. What is on here? Butter? Okay. Son of a bitch. Okay, hold on, guys. Hold on, hold on. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to figure it out. Come on. <gasps> I'm going to figure it out, guys. Just stop clowning me in the comments. Stop posting L's in the comments. Son of a bitch. Right, up, straight, up, right, up, left, up, left, up. Oh my god, I'm almost there. Right. No! Okay. Right, up, left, up, right, up, left, left, up, up, right. Yes! I got the castle of sand! I am the king! I am the king of the rock climbing! Okay, so Ozzy has an inhaler inside of the locker. I think I gotta tell him. Did you hear what Ozzy said? He has another inhaler. What are we gonna do? We can steal that too. Good. We continue with the plan then. We just need to adapt a little. How so? 
We've got some things to do. One is to find a green flower. Ozzy is highly allergic. Just seeing one should be enough to freak him out. Okay, I know where to go to get the flower because I saw one over here. I saw it right back here. Give me some. Bam! Okay. At least I know where the stuff is now. I'm getting familiar with the game. Did you get the flower? Yup. Wow, you are good. So now we just have to get into the locker and steal the backup inhaler. How do we do that? There's only one person that could get us into that locker. And I put gum in our hair this morning. Oh no. Well, let's see if we can smooth things over with her. Maybe she'll forgive me. I hope so. She looks mad as hell right now. I don't have the scissors, by the way. Get in line, gringo. It's still my turn to jump on the trampoline. We have a job for you. Is that so? Oh, yeah. And why would I be so inclined to help the kid who put gum in my hair this morning? I'm really sorry about that, but if it helps, my plan has been pretty... Shut it, snob. Did you get those scissors I asked for? I didn't. Crap. Okay, so we have the scissors now. Good. At least I got that going for me. So will you help us? Ugh, I guess. If you do me one more favor. You see that kid in the wheelchair over there? He's been making some moves on my turf today. I gotta show him not to do that. How? Here's a screwdriver. See to it that his wheels are <laughs> less than operable. No! <laughs> no way! He'll see us! There's two of you. One of you pretend to buy something from the little fence while the other sneaks behind him and pops out a screw. It's not that complicated. We got this! Good. Come see me when it's done. Will do. Uh, I guess we'll have to do this. We will have to further disable a cripple. I feel sick. You're trying to kill another kid. That's different. I know Felix has good reason for... Never mind. Let's just get it over with. Right. Before we do, if you want to buy or sell stuff, you should probably do it now. I doubt he'll be in the mood after we ruin his day. Good idea. Okay, I think that we're good. So, what we're gonna do... We can actually get $2 for the inhaler. So I guess I'll do that. So let's go behind him. Should I remove a screw from Monty's wheelchair? Yes. Oh, sorry, Monty. Oh, oh no. No, 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 no. What happened to my chair? This sucks. Why is this happening to me? Oh my. I, uh, I'll let you get yourself together. We'll talk later when you're, um, not on the floor. Just get out of here. Well done. Okay, a deal's a deal. I'll see to it that Ozzy's locker is open by the time you get to it. Can you grab the inhaler for us? That's not part of our deal. You only said the locker. You're gonna have to grab whatever you want out of it by yourself, okay? I feel pretty bad about that, but it was necessary. Sure it was. It's almost time to do the actual job now. Are you ready for your big moment? What do I have to do? When the bell rings, pay the lab fee and go to science. That's where Ozzy goes after recess. Then what? Once you're there, cause a distraction and sneak out. Grab the inhaler out of his locker. Once you have it, show Ozzy the flower. He should fall apart and die. Sounds like a plan. Felix and I will meet you after school. If all goes well, you'll be handsomely rewarded. See you then. Okay, let's go to science class and let's get weird. Go away, kid. I'm trying to learn about plants. Check out this plant. Oh, no. Get that away from me. <laughs> I think I'm having an asthma. <laughs> Give him some room! Damn it, Ozzy! We've been over this! Where's your inhaler? <gasps> it's in my <sighs> locker! Please hurry! Oh, dude, I feel so bad for Ozzy! Here! Take a breath! Don't let this happen again! Oh, shit! What is wrong with you? Why did you do that? I could have died! Shit! Sorry about that! Sorry! How could you feel if you couldn't breathe? Probably like you did a few seconds ago? And how you're gonna feel right now? How's that? Oh, he's giving me the chokies! He's giving me the choky chicken! Ozzy can get back up with a vengeance after using his inhaler. Okay, let me try talking to somebody. That pretty flower you have, can I have it? Only if you help me. There we go, I think this is it. Help you? I guess I could, what do you need? I need a distraction. I don't know, Dr. Danner seems smarter than Miss Applegate. He probably won't fall for any old distraction. You're gonna need something big, like what? Gosh, boys are stupid. Just look at this place. I'm sure there is something you can use. Maybe by the computers or something. I'll see what I can do. Is it the lesson plan? Right here? I could have changed the lesson plan if I had gotten to this sooner. Um, what, this? No. Oh, I should tell Cindy. There you go. Well, what's your big distraction idea? We're going to use the electrical outlet. The electrical outlet? How's that going to create a distraction? Stick this in it? Oh no, what's that going to do? 
Mega distraction. If you insist, but I want that flower before I do anything. I could get in trouble, but it'll be worth it for something so pretty. Maybe I'll find something else then. Oh man, I gotta give him that flower though because he's allergic. So I guess I needed two flowers, huh? Unless I can give her the flower, then take the flower off her dead body. Oh goody! Get ready to run. Here comes a distraction. I'm ready. Okay, so maybe she'll die and then I can grab the flower. Hey, Dr. Danner, look what I'm doing. What? Wait, what are you doing? That's not a good idea. Oh, shit, Cindy. You new children are dumber than the monkeys whose brains are removed. Okay, nobody move. I'm sure the power will be back on soon. Okay, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move and I'm gonna leave. So let's grab this. Oh, wait. Where's his locker? There you go, take the inhaler. Maybe I can get the flower from her. Yeah, let me try checking out her body. Maybe I can get the flower from her lifeless body. There you go, take the flower. Oh, there we go. Everyone get back to doing science. Woo, there we go, guys. Okay, I feel so bad for Cindy, but you know what? You gotta do what you gotta do, guys. Go away, kid. I'm trying to learn about plants. Check out this plant. Ah, no, get that away from me. I think... I'm having an asthma. <laughs> Give him some room. Damn it, Ozzy. We've been over this. Where's your inhaler? Get in my locker, please. Hurry. Oh, yeah. No inhaler for you, you son of a bitch. Well, Ozzy, I have some bad news. It's not there. So it looks like you're going to die here, but don't worry. It won't be in vain. If you sign on the dotted line here, I'm semi-legally allowed to use your body for science. <gasps> I'll just forge it for him. It's what he would have wanted. Good news, everyone. I've suddenly come into possession of a cadaver. Tomorrow's lesson will be on anatomy. <laughs> I just noticed the body count on today's class has been slightly higher than average. Perhaps we could end the day a little early. Everyone go home. All right, let's go home, guys. Bodies on bodies. And now, Ted and Felix, they're going to congratulate me. At least they better, because that was a long mission. There he is, Felix. I told you he would do it. I... I didn't see Ozzy come out of school. Did you really do what my brother is suggesting? Yup. Fascinating. Um, well done then. This is exactly what I wanted. Yes, exactly. I knew we could do it. And we did it all without your help. Yes, I'm sure your father will be quite proud. Give him his reward. Give him the thing. Oh, yes. Um, here you are. What is it? It's a pin from our company. It represents that you are a trustworthy ally to our family. Cool. Say, Teddy, would you mind telling the driver I'll be a minute? I just need a moment to talk to our new friend here. Sure thing, Felix. Before I go, take this Monstermon card. It looks kind of like Ozzy did before he, um... Bye! Stress Llama. Oh dear, what a mess. A mess? This wasn't supposed to happen. Ozzy wasn't supposed to die. You didn't want Ozzy dead? Goodness, no. I wanted Ted dead. Why? Perhaps we could discuss the matter tomorrow? Perhaps. Excellent. Good day to you, Hitman. Good day. Alright, so I guess we're a kindergarten Hitman. And we got a prestigious pin. And we got new clothing. A spoiled pink dress? Germaphobe stripes? And we got some Monstermon cards. Because you guys already know what I do. Alright, another Tuesday, but before we do... Let me take off this suit... Let me put on my pink dress because I want to look nice and snazzy. And, uh, hmm. You know what? Let's do a little Ozzy, 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 oi, oi, oi. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, look at us. Oh, yeah, we look great. We look fabulous. All right, guys, so we have a prestigious pin. We have Bob's tool belt. And we can also do Nugget's mission. There we go. Start the mission by talking to Nugget and then give the tool belt to Bob. So we can now do Nugget's mission. I was wondering why we couldn't do it earlier in the episode. But now it is time to get to Nugget Cave. If you guys want to see that episode as soon as possible, make sure you guys give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is dead. Dude!